Guys, today I will show you how to make an adjustable battery full charge indicator circuit. So, let's look at the diagram first to understand how it works. As you can see, here we have TL431 shunt regulator IC as main component, which actually turns on the negative voltage from pin 2 to pin 3 when reference pin 1 receives the required positive voltage, which is controlled and calibrated by this voltage divider. Here this charging red LED receives positive from this 1 kilo ohms resistor and negative from this 1 kilo ohms resistor. And this green full LED receives positive from this 1 kilo ohms resistor and negative from pin 3 of shunt regulator IC. As I told when shunt regulator receives required positive voltage on pin 1, it passes negative voltage connected with pin 2 to pin 3. So the positive current from this resistor goes ground, and red LED turns off, and green LED turns on, that will indicate battery is fully charged. And here short key diode is used to differentiate the input and battery voltage, so that reference voltage can be picked from battery side, to turn on full LED at exact calibrated voltage. So, let's make this circuit to see how it works practically and how to calibrate it. Here we have 431 shunt regulator IC. Pin 1 is reference. Pin 2 is anode. And pin 3 is cathode. Take a green LED. Solder LED negative with pin 3 of shunt regulator. Take red LED. Solder it in reverse polarity on green LED. Take 1 kilo ohms resistor. Solder between LEDs and pin 2 of shunt regulator. Use 10K multi-turn potentiometer. Solder potentiometer pin 3 with pin 1 of shunt regulator. Using jumper connect pin 2 of shunt regulator with pin 2 of potentiometer. Take 4.7 kilo ohms resistor. Solder on pin 1 of shunt regulator. Take 1 kilo ohms resistor. Solder on pin 3 of shunt regulator. Solder another 1 kilo ohms resistor here on LEDs. Use any short key diode between 1 to 3 amperes as per your current requirements. Solder cathode with 4.7K resistor, and anode with both 1K resistors. Ok, now our circuit is almost ready. Here is input DC positive. And here is input DC negative. Here is battery positive. And here battery negative. Now our circuit is ready to test, and we need to calibrate circuit with this potentiometer, and to calibrate the circuit for any particular voltage, we need a variable power source. I made this variable controller in my previous video, that you can also check out on my channel. This is DC input side to connect with this variable power source. Also connect multimeter to monitor output voltage, as there will be little voltage drop by short key diode. Now, suppose I will calibrate it for 13.5 volts, so set output at 13.5 volts. Then use the screwdriver and adjust the potentiometer clockwise till green LED turns on, like this I did. Now it's calibrated for 13.5 volts, so whenever during charging battery voltage is below 13.5, red LED will remain on indicates charging. And when battery voltage touch 13.5 volts, green LED will indicate fully charged. Now suppose calibrate it for 12.6 volts, so set output at 12.6 volts. 
fuel screwdriver and adjust potentiometer clockwise till green LED turns on. And as you can see, red LED remain on if below then 12.6 volts. And green LED turns on at 12.6 volts. For more videos subscribe the channel. And also check out these recommended videos. Thanks for watching.